I want to share with you an exciting piece of technology that can drastically improve the life of a person who's visually impaired or blind. I have in my hand what is called the OrCam MyEye Pro. And this is a wearable device that a person can attach to a pair of glasses, which OrCam will provide you with a pair of glasses, and has a magnetic attachment on the side that this camera actually attaches to. And it also comes with spare attachments so you can really connect it with any pair of glasses or sunglasses that you like. So I now have my OrCam attached to my favorite pair of shades and I'm going to use different finger gestures like swiping, tapping, or long pressing to use the camera to actually interact with my environment. And then there's actually a small speaker that's built into the device that's going to speak what's in the environment directly into my ear. So the OrCam volume can be adjusted and put very low so it's very discreet and only you can hear it. You can also connect the device to earbuds and the features themselves can be set to automatic or manual so that you have to actually prompt the device to read or tell you what's in the environment or they can just be automatic so as you're moving freely it will speak to you. So all of these settings can be adjusted within the settings menu of the device and there's a couple features that can be actually disabled and enabled with a simple voice command. So when I'm working, maybe I have a recipe that takes an extended period of time, I can hook my OrCam directly up to this external battery source and it'll give me a longer life. Okay, let's jump into what this device can actually do. So I have my favorite skate mag here, Thrasher, and I'm going to simply take a photo of what's in my environment by tapping the side of my camera and it's going to give me feedback as to what it sees. So I'm going to hold up an article and I'm going to look directly at it Take a photo. So I'm going to double tap to pause. And as you see, it's, it literally will just start reading if there's text. And then within this text, I can close this bag and put it anywhere I want because it's all saved on the device right now. So double tap to continue. I can, re I can rewind. I can fast forward. And listen to the text that it reads. Now I'm going to combine these finger gestures with voice commands to interact with some text. I'm going to enable the smart reading feature. Double tapping, listening for a chime, which the device will always give some kind of audio signal to you to let you know what's going on. Start smart reading. So I can, now I can use voice commands to actually interact with this text. Super helpful features are, I'm going to say a couple here, so read phone numbers. Okay. Read the amounts. Found seven amounts. First result, insurance patient $145.0020920. So some other features on top of the read the amounts and read the phone numbers are things like read the dates, jump to or start from, which you can actually jump to or start from a specific word or phrase within the text, um, as well as uh, repeat or restart, and then it will actually retake a photo of whatever is in front of you, and then you can repeat whatever function it has already spoken. Another fun feature is the orientation setting within the device. So this is going to help me identify certain things in the environment. The device will speak to me when it sees chairs, tables, cups, doors, ascending stairs, and screens. It will actually tell you whether the screen is on or off. So to enable the orientation, I'm going to do the double tap, listen for my chime, I'm going to speak what's in front of me. I'm going to look around and we're just going to listen to what it tells me. What's in front of me? No relevant objects found. No relevant objects found. A door in the center. A door in, my, in the center. A door to the right. I'm gonna look to the left. A screen in the center. There's a screen. I have my computer over here. I am listening. Exit. Exiting. So you can see how that can be super helpful for when I'm when I'm actually navigating, trying to find the entrance to a building. And it will actually direct you, when it says a door, it will direct you to the actual handle. Or if it's a set of stairs, it will direct you to the handrail. 
and it'll help you guide you to those to that specific point. Um, super helpful. Now I want to highlight one of my favorite features of the My Eye Pro. This is the facial recognition feature, and this literally will speak to me uh, the name of a person when they're in front of me, and it will actually do up to three people, which is pretty much the standard amount of people that can be in front of you without actually having to widen and start a circle. And it will read these faces from left to right. So I'm able to save a person's face by holding my finger on the device, and then I'll have that person look up, down, left, right, all around, put glasses on, take them off, put a mask on, take a mask off, and then I can save the name as anything I would like. Um, and then the next time that they're in front of me, it will actually speak that name. What's up? Skater Steve. Steve! So this is one of the features that can actually be enabled and disabled with a simple voice command by just saying enable or disable facial recognition. Another helpful function is the ability to recognize barcodes and products. So the device itself can already recognize over 2 million products by itself, right out of the box. So if I simply look at a barcode, it will tell me whether it recognizes that barcode or not. And if it doesn't, I can actually save it as anything that I want. And this can be super, super helpful when I'm within the kitchen. Um, say I scan something and it's uh, something that I use a lot, I can actually record up to four seconds of some kind of recipe or maybe the temperature I need to cook that at. I'm rifling through my spice cabinet. I have two identical containers of spices. I need to know what these are. Take a picture. Whole cloves. Garlic powder. I don't want to mix those up. So let's see how this is actually practical. So I have two boxes of shoes here. If I, if I don't know otherwise, I wouldn't know what model these are or maybe what color they are. So I've actually saved these barcodes ahead of time. And now I can pull them out of my closet and all I have to do is look at the barcode. Adidas Campus Orange with White Stripes. Adidas Campus Orange with White Stripes. What else do we have? Adidas Booznitz Blue with Neon Green Stripe. So the product feature, I can go, if it's not a barcode, I can take a photo of a product and I can save that as well. And I like to use this for skateboards I have to find my favorite graphics. So again, so we look up. This one I'm gonna take a photo by tapping. Favorite Ashad graphic. My favorite Ashad graphic. So you can only imagine how much easier this device makes my life. I use it every day around the house, whether I'm just picking out some stickers that I need, make sure I'm getting the right. Real skateboards. Real skateboards, right? Or maybe I'm at the store and I need to purchase something. I have currency. Let's just read this bank note. One dollar. One dollar? Uh, that's not gonna cut it. What else do I have here? Twenty dollars. That makes more sense. So I also use the My Eye Pro when picking out clothes because I can usually I can simply just put up my hand and point at an item, and it will tell me the color if I hold it there. Black area. Black. That's what I'm looking for. I can't say enough good things about the OrCam My Eye Pro. This device actually can grant you know a vision impaired or blind person more independence, more freedom, and really just make their life easier. So thank you, Orcam.